guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are outside of my local Old Navy. Well, there's like three Old Navies near me. Um, I have not, sorry, we're doing an inside the dressing room video. I'm very excited because we have not done an inside the dressing room video since before the pandemic. Um, I literally feel like I have not been in store clothes shopping anywhere besides like Target in over, well over like a year and a half. So I'm very excited to go in here and see what they have because Old Navy, if you guys didn't know about this, they did bring all their sizes in store. So I am super excited about that. I feel like it's a long time coming. I really hope other stores kind of catch, catch on to that idea and bring all the sizes in store that they do offer online because we want to shop in store too. Um, so yeah, this video is not sponsored in any way. I am just very excited and want to go inside and like see what they have. That being said, the last time I was inside an Old Navy that did have the plus sizes, because at one point they were like testing out the theory of if they brought the plus sizes in the store, if they would sell. And I remember that pretty well. This was before the pandemic, I believe right before maybe. Um, don't quote me on that, but I do remember that point when they were testing it out and I did drive like over an hour to go to the one that did have the plus sizes in the store. And I tried on a bunch of their stuff and I feel like I was a little bit um, disappointed because, because they just had like a lot of sizing inconsistencies. Um, and I remember like the street size 2X because Old Navy typically goes up to an XXL in store before they brought the plus sizes in, um, fit me better than like the plus size 3X. So I'm just kind of like excited and a little nervous to see what we get into in the store. Right now, my body is a little bit like in between sizes, I feel like. I'm, I'm in between sizes, so it may make it a little bit harder right now. I don't really know. <laughs> Again, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just... We're just along for the ride. We're along for what we can find in the store. I am gonna film this voiceover, like the actual inside the dressing room part voiceover because I'm gonna be wearing a mask inside. I don't know if it's necessary, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Um, so yeah, let's get in, I'm so excited. So this is the first pair of jeans. As you can see, they do not fit at all. <laughs> These are a size 24 in the OG straight. And obviously I can get them buttoned, but not zipped. Um, they just weren't that comfortable as well. Like they were kind of just a bizarre fit in general. Not my fave. Um, I feel like they had like a 1% stretch. So they just weren't that comfortable. And I don't know, my American Eagle jeans that have the same amount of stretch, like the 1% stretch, I have in a 22 and they're like baggy and comfortable. So I don't know. I just was not feeling these at all. Okay, so this next outfit, um, the pants, like I didn't like it first, but they kind of grew on me by the end of this little like section here. They are a paper bag waist cargo style jogger pant. Um, no stretch, but they're very comfortable and soft. I tried these on in a 4X and they fit me perfectly. Um, they had great like cargo pockets. I liked the high rise. And then the top is just this like cropped little white tee that you guys know I already love. <laughs> um, and that one was in a XXL. All right, now this next outfit I had mixed feelings about. Um, the pants are too big. They are like another non-stretch like jogger style pant um the top I thought was kind of cute like I almost was on the fence of buying it because I could just kind of like see it with other things but 
I didn't end up getting it. The top was in a 3X, bottom was in a 4X. The bottom was a little bit too big and just a little matronly. I didn't, I didn't love it. Um, I mean the bottoms. I hope I said the bottoms on the top. <laughs> and the top I didn't get either, but at the end of the day, I liked it. I just didn't like it enough to buy it. Okay, this next dress I thought was very cute. It was a midi length white and black gingham printed dress. Um, I really liked the define waist. It had some darts under the breast that I thought were very cute. It also had pockets, which is very, just a win. It's super cute. Um, the fabric of this was a little bit different. It was kind of more geared towards fall because it was like a soft, almost like a knitted type of fabric. I could see this one like with a black or white little like mock neck underneath it for the fall with some little black booties. I don't know. I thought it was cute. I definitely was on the fence of buying it, but I didn't end up picking it up. Um, I tried this on in a 3X. And if you guys like these things, definitely wait till this weekend because I think they're going to have some great Labor Day sales. All right, so here is a beautiful blue and white floral dress. This is a great example of don't let the size like scare you. This dress is in a size XL, but it fits me perfectly. It's just a beautiful like trapeze style dress. Um, it reminded me of something I saw at H&M and it was beautiful, but I didn't end up picking it up. Um, but yeah, don't be afraid of what the size of the tag says, whether it's up or down, just give it a try. Sometimes you'll be pleasantly surprised. All right. Now this next outfit is definitely one of their active wear little outfits that they had paired together. I really enjoyed these shorts. Um, this top is just a cropped white top that has biggie on it. I liked the colors. They match the shorts perfectly. But the shorts were just super comfortable, very stretchy, not too compression-like. Like, they just were a great biker short, and I really like the hunter green color. Um, they had a nice thick waistband at the top. Just overall, really great fit and feel. These were in a size 3X. Both pieces, actually, that I tried on were in a size 3X. So loved these, but did not get them. All right, now this next thing is a sleepwear set. I was really happy to see that they also had sleepwear in the plus sizes. These fit really great. They were super soft and comfy. Um, I had the bottom shorts on in a size 3X. They were, again, great and comfy. They had a cute little, like, split. I don't know what that's called. I want to say tulip hem, but I don't think it is. Um, and then the top I tried on in a 2X, and they all just fit great. Like, super soft, super comfy, 10 out of 10. Loved it very comfy, very soft. Okay, this next top um, is just like a cute little rust colored linen top. Um, it's one of those tops where I don't always love the style, like the, the top, I feel like it cuts my boobs in a weird spot. Um, that being said, it was also kind of just like boxy and not really the like most flattering on me at least. Um, and then I tried it on with this cream colored sweater it was I like my cardigans to be kind of like cozy and oversized and this one just fit regular um, top was in an XXL sweater was in a 2x all right this is the last thing I tried on it's this like mock neck sweatshirt um, this was cute kind of just like a nice little cozy piece of activewear I did like the neck I love a mock neck I love the color very comfy very cute I got this one in a size 3x and it fit pretty well um, just a cozy little sweater. Okay, hi guys. So I just came back out. Um, overall, I will say my feelings about Old Navy are still the same. Um, they still have pretty inconsistent sizing, um, which is fine because, you know, size is just a number, but just it's frustrating, I think, for people who go into the store and would like grab their regular size either try it on or just buy it and then it just doesn't work for them um so the jeans that I tried on did not fit at all you guys saw that um yeah they just didn't work I actually tried on two other pairs of shorts which I didn't film because literally my entire like underwear situation would have been out but I tried them on in a 26 which is two sizes up and they didn't work for me so 
<laughs> like couldn't even pull them up over my stomach. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I think their jeans are just not for me. Um, that being said, like some of their other clothes also have different inconsistencies, like with their sizing. For example, that beautiful blue floral dress I tried on was an XL and some of the other things I tried on were like 3X, 4X. So like you really just can't go by the number, which can be a little bit more, um, difficult and frustrating when going to shop online or in store. So just know that with Old Navy, like pick up a couple different sizes and kind of figure out where you are with their sizing because it's a little bit different. Um, that being said, like I love Old Navy. I think they have pretty cute basics. Like I love their tees. Those bike shorts are pretty cute. I love their like little cropped t-shirts. I ended up picking up um, a regular old white tank because hello, I love a white tank. I wish they had good white t-shirts. I also think they're kind of like in between their transition right now. Like they're trying to get some of their summer stuff out and put their fall stuff out, but like not all their fall stuff's out and they still have like newer summer stuff out. So they're kind of like in a weird spot with that. So I may come back like later in the season and just see what they have. Um, and just like not go for their jeans. Cause that really was not a fun experience. <laughs> um, let's see. So yeah, I just picked up two of their regular tees. This is just the cropped white tee that I thought would be cute with some high-waisted jeans and then another little cropped tee in, you know, my favorite color, nude brown, <laughs> um, that I found on the way out and just picked it up. This one's in a 2X, this one's in an XXL, and the tank's in an XXL. So yeah, I would just say like Old Navy is great. I really give them huge kudos for finally bringing in all of their sizes that they do offer online to the in stores or to the stores. Um, so yeah, huge kudos for that. I just would say like if you're going to go in, don't just buy something off the shelf assuming it's going to work for you. Definitely try it on because there can be a little bit of inconsistencies there. So yeah, guys, um, I'm hoping more stores will follow suit and take their online plus sections in their stores. That would be amazing. Um, like I would have loved this as a little girl, like, or, or teenager even, like going shopping with my friends and having them go in the stores and like actually being able to find something that worked for me. And I know Old Navy is kind of different because I can wear their XXLs, but just like think about your younger child, <laughs> like your inner child too, who wanted just wanted to shop with their friends and couldn't pick out anything in the same stores as them so kudos to you old navy again but yeah all right guys i'm gonna end this video let me know where you want to see next i think i'm gonna go to target this weekend or next weekend and do it there um because their dressing rooms are open and oh yeah about the mask thing i know you guys saw me like have my mask on and then i took it off masks were not required in there like nobody was wearing one and i was in the dressing room literally alone there was like no one in the store because it's three o'clock on a tuesday um so yeah but I will see you guys later. I love you and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.